Hi, I'm Les. Les Duthis. Welcome to my channel. For today's adventure, we'll be evaluating two dead cat options for the Deity VMic D3 Pro microphone. Our contenders are the $15 Your Shares microphone dead cat windscreen and the $28 Movo WS G120 furry rigid windscreen. Links are in the description below. First, we'll talk about what a dead cat ought to be. Then we'll look at these two designs and their ease of use. Finally, we'll compare recordings made with each dead cat and evaluate them on wind noise suppression and acoustic transparency. Then we'll summarize everything so that you can decide which one is right for you and your daily VMic D3 Pro. All right, let's do this. So in case you're wondering what a dead cat is, it's a wind noise suppressor that looks like a furry animal pelt, like a cat has. And by wind noise, I mean imagine when somebody blows gently into your ear. It sounds terrible. You want them to stop right away. That's what a microphone is up against, except the wind gusts aren't always so gentle. Now imagine somebody blowing into your ear through a fur coat. That's not so bad. That's basically what a dead cat is. On a windy day, the fur layer breaks up and diverts the wild airflow so it can't rip across the eardrum of your microphone. Another important quality of a dead cat is its acoustic transparency. We want it to suppress wind noise, but we don't want it to suppress anything else. For every other kind of sound, we want the dead cat to seem like it's not even there. So enough about that. Let's look at our two designs. The Your Shares Microphone Dead Cat Windscreen costs $14.99, and it's a hairy sack that mounts over the Deity Foam Windscreen and kind of cinches down in the back with a draw cord. It is not super easy to get it mounted over the Deity Foam Windscreen. But once it's in place, if you leave it as an assembly, it's just as easy to get on and off as the Deity Foam. Also, you can see it doesn't provide complete fur coverage for the back of the microphone. We'll see if this is an issue during testing. Check out the hair quality. This is nice and soft. Next up, we have the Movo WS G120 Furry Rigid Windscreen, which is selling for $27.95. The description says that there's an inner layer of acoustic foam. I'm guessing this is right below the fur layer. The material directly in contact with the microphone is kind of like a plastic scouring pad material. To mount it, you take the Deity Foam Windscreen off, and then take the Movo and work the rubber sealing ring all the way back until it covers all the side slits in the microphone. Then you check that the rubber sealing ring is not touching the shock mount. If it is, you ease it up a little bit until there's about an eighth of an inch clearance. I use the leading edge of the M in V mic on the top of the microphone as the marker for how far back to put the rubber sealing ring. It is pretty easy to get on and it feels well made. The fit is just right for this microphone. The hair on the Movo looks unkempt like a feral dog, but it is just as soft as the competition. Movo calls this material simulated rabbit fur. And to wrap up this section, we'll look at weight. The Your Shares Dead Cat combined with the Deity Foam Windscreen weighs 32 grams. The Movo Dead Cat weighs 46 grams. Now, for the testing, we'll set the Deity Microphone's gain knob to 5 and leave it there. Each test will occur in the same spot so that we can compare apples to apples and not other fruits. Now, on to the tests. First, we'll do a wind noise suppression test, and then we'll do an acoustic transparency test. This should give us a good overall dead cat performance picture. For the first test, I took a fan, set it on high, and placed the microphone 15 inches away. This is our controlled windstorm. Then I recorded audio in three configurations. Deity Foam, Your Shares Dead Cat, and Movo Dead Cat. With just the Deity Foam, I got lots of explosive wind noise. This is unbearable. With the Your Shares Dead Cat, things are much better. With the Movo Dead Cat, Things are even better. This looks really good. Comparing all three waveforms on the screen at once, 
we see that the MOVO is the one you want to have in the windstorm. Now we'll do another wind noise suppression test. The first test had the fan blowing from the side. This test will simulate a following wind. This will test if the lack of fur coverage on the back of the Your Shares dead cat is a significant issue. It seems like it's not really a significant issue. Moving on to the next test, I played the same sound clip three times in a quiet room and recorded the audio with each setup. First I used the Deity Foam. This is our baseline. This is a test of the emergency dead cat system. This is only a test. Next is the Your Shares dead cat. This is a test of the emergency dead cat system. This is only a test. Which isn't much different a result. This is a test of the emergency dead cat system. This is only a test. Finally, we see that the MOVO's result is a little attenuated, but not very much. So to recap, we see that both the Your Shares and the MOVO dead cats are viable options for the Deity VMIC D3 Pro. The Movo Dead Cat is better at wind suppression, and the Your Shares Dead Cat is a hair more acoustically transparent. Moreover, the Your Shares Dead Cat is about half the price and 30% lighter weight. Which one would I choose? Well, having been on some pretty windy shoots, I'd go for the one that has the maximum wind suppression capability in a convenient footprint. And in this case, that's the Movo. Convenience wise, the Your Shares Dead Cat might have an edge if you don't ever need to use the Deity Foam on its own and you just have the Your Shares Dead Cat mounted all the time. It's really easy to take on and off. But since I want to use the Deity Foam in some situations and a Dead Cat in other situations, I'm not up for doing that swaparoo over and over again of mounting the Your Shares Dead Cat on the foam and taking it off. So the Movo WS G120 is the winner for my purposes. If you've had a different experience or remarks, feel free to post in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and as always, remember, the only good cat is a dead cat.